<laughs> Hi guys, so um, today is another day and right now I'm at church. We just finished the service, we are about to eat something, do a bit of gift exchange and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, it's so awkward because my church people are looking at me like, this girl must be crazy. Um, so yeah, but it was a good service. Today is the 31st as well. Um, so yeah, I'm just chilling. We're not doing crossover service this year, which is so sad because I was looking forward to it. But yeah, life happened, didn't it? But we're gonna be here for like seven hours. That's long. <laughs> um, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. The service is done and I'm back at home. Right now it is 1.16 Monday 1st of January 2018. That is so crazy to say. Um, well I keep looking at myself there instead of focusing on the lens. Anyway, um, 2017 has been such, well was such an emotional year in general because so many things happened like so many failed plans so many um trials so many decision making that just you know did not work out um depression although like i tried to avoid the them subject because it's like it's really hard to like talk about it um, I don't even know cry on camera because I've already done my fair bit of crying already and I just wanna stay calm um, but like I'm but <laughs> I need to articulate my words properly okay so guys wow I'll be right back <laughs> also the lighting here is really poor sorry about that um yeah the ending of 2017 however was amazing like i learned a lot about myself i met amazing people and i just celebrated life you know and i just lived for a bit and um the middle of just the middle of 2017 however was a different story there was just so much going on and it was just like I just could did not know where to place myself and I was just so confused and I was in the right place like I would stay in my bedroom literally five days in a row without stepping out like I was just miserable long story short and then the ending it got better but um Maybe it's because I got a job and then it meant that I was stepping out of the house and actually doing something 
um so I, I guess i kind of found a reason to leave the house wow i can't believe me i really don't want to cry on camera Whew. um but yeah i'm grateful for the year though because i learned a lot and the everything that happened and every all the skills that i gained and the people that i lost and the people that came into my life has all been like life lessons that should be appreciated and i'm trying so hard to look at the lens but it's so hard because i feel like when i look at it it just makes my eyes get all teary and i don't want that so i just keep looking away sorry um 2018 however oh bring it on i'm ready and i'm just ready to rock you know because i feel like it's gonna be such a good year like i feel like my sister by the way my sister is playing stuff at the background hence why you can hear all the noise but um 2018 well, I, I just know that so many good things are going to happen and i've kind of left everything in god's hands and in god's control to kind of take me one day at a time and to kind of just lead my path because he knows better he knows what my future holds and he knows tomorrow so i'm like do you know what god take control take over my body my mind my soul everything is in your hands and i just wanna thank god for seeing me through 2017 and for being with me and my family and he has amazing things planned for me in 2018 and i'm excited you guys should be excited i think you i thank all of you as well and i hope you had a good christmas and a happy new year and you know that all your dreams all your wishes and everything that you want everything that you need for that matter are true and you know you run your race and all of that um so yeah happy new year <laughs> yes and i did not cry so i'm happy um but yeah <laughs> peace thanks for watching guys i appreciate it